On January 3, 2014, a six-year-old girl named Ana Souza was riding a public bus in Maranhão, Brazil with her mother and baby sister when a man with a gun approached the bus and ordered everybody to get off. The man was part of a gang that had been lighting public buses on fire in retaliation to prison conditions in Brazil. Only a few people had left the bus when other members of the gang sprayed gas on the steps and lit them on fire. Six-year-old Anna and her family were caught in the blaze. Ninety-five percent of Anna's body was covered in burns, and as a result, she died three days later. Her baby sister, who was a year and a half old, had burns to 20% of her body, and the 22-year-old mother suffered burns to 40% of her body, but both survived. Two other people were injured in the fire, but survived as well. Eleven people were detained for the crime, two of them teenagers. There were also four other bus attacks. The original amount of buses targeted was at least 20. Authorities in the São Luís region believe the attack was ordered from inside the Pendrinha prison in protest of the new measures taken to control the violence inside the prison, as well as the deplorable conditions that the prisoners endure. Anna's father, Winderson de Sosa, said, I've just buried my daughter. It's terrible pain. There's no logic to this. Such cruelty. Hundreds of people attended Anna's funeral, demanding an end to the wave of gang-led terror.